Hey everyone, this is Video Game Fan 1999 here, and it is time for me to do uh, my next gameplay video for my channel. Today I'm going to be playing Kirby's Dream Course for the SNES. So let's get started. Now this game is actually a golf game, but with Kirby, obviously. Let me reset the software here. We'll do a one player game. Let me get myself signed in. We're just going to play course one. Alright, here we go. Now what you're supposed to do in this game is that you got to defeat the enemies that are on each all, all throughout the course here. And as you defeat the enemies, the last one becomes the hole and that's where you're supposed to go oh, to complete uh, the hole right here. So anyways, um, for the controls in this game, you just uh, move around uh, with the control stick and you can also uh, adjust your power by going up or down. If you, if you basically uh, press up, you can basically um, go into a chip shot, or if you go down, you can choose to have some additional power. So that's what we're gonna do right here. Now to prepare your shot, you just basically uh, press A on where you want to aim. And then you just press A to start uh, your power meter, and then you, you press the A button again to take your shot. And looks like we're gonna get a hole in one to start off. Nice. And if you get a hole in one on a certain hole, then you'll get a one up as well. So we're off to a good start here. And there's also eight holes on each course as well. Anyways, we're now gonna go to hole number two. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I'll say I'm right about here. Almost had it. That's okay. So we made in the hole in three shots that time. So that's not bad. Uh, now it's time for hole number three. Oh, I got a power shot this time, but I missed that one enemy right there. That wasn't too good. Let's see if I can actually hit him this time. There we go. I also got a special ability as well. I got the high jump here. It basically gets a, a, a little bit of uh, extra distance here once you use it. And to use your special ability in this game, you just uh, press the B button. So we got in the hole in four shots on that one. It's alright. Moving on to hole number four. Now there's a war path right here. It basically takes you to another certain point on the map. And I just got hit by that enemy right there. And each time you actually uh, take up a shot, Kirby uh, loses a bit of health right here. You gotta pay attention to your health meter each time you actually uh, take a shot because if you run out of health then you'll lose a life. We got in the hole in three shots right there. That's pretty good. All right, moving on to hole number five. Oh, 
I almost had a power shot there, but that is okay. Let's use my high jump ability. Oh, we couldn't quite get over there, but that's okay. Now this time I'm actually going to use a chip shot here. Oh, how did I get hit there? That was weird. Now Kirby's getting a little bit tired here, so we gotta be careful. Oh, how did I miss that? That wasn't good. There we go. Got it in the hole. And four shots right there, but that's okay. Alright, let's jump into hole number six. And also, if you choose to take a chip shot, you can choose if you want to have top spin or back spin as well. Now I have a parasol here. We're gonna use it right here so we can make a, a landing right here near the hole. All right, that wasn't too bad. Got it in the hole in three shots. All right. Only a couple more horses to go, so let's go to hole number seven. We're gonna do a chip shot here, and we're gonna apply some top spin this time. So if we do that right there, we can basically skip across the water, which is definitely very handy. Alright, that was very good. Got it in the hole in two shots. Alright. So now it is time for the eighth and final hole. We're gonna aim right here. And we can step on this button here to drain all the water here. I'll just barely uh, hit that enemy right there. That was close. Alright, let's see what we're gonna do about this shot here. Oh, power shot! Oh, so close. That's okay. We'll finish off that hole with three shots right there. I'll take it. And we've completed the course. And we get a total score of 23. That's pretty good. My best score is 16. But we still did a pretty good job. And I get ranked in 20th overall, and I got a bronze medal as well. That was a pretty good game right there. Alright. Anyways, that is going to do it for my gameplay of Kirby's Dream Course for the SNES. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video.